Devastation there. In meantime, local volunteers are in West Virginia helping with the recovery. CBS North Carolina's Kristen Ketchell spoke to one of them about their experience. Kristen. Well, as West Virginia residents continue to clean up the damage from last week's deadly floods, volunteers from the eastern North Carolina region of the Red Cross are assisting in the relief efforts. Over the weekend, 14 volunteers were sent to the flood-ravaged areas. They're providing meals, shelter, relief supplies, and other assistance to those affected. I spoke to one volunteer on the phone earlier today about what it means to her to help those who lost everything. It's hard to put something like that into words as a Red Cross volunteer. I uh, step up to the plate expecting that my heart and soul and every bit of my emotion is going to go into my job. But when I see people that are suffering through this, there aren't just enough words or the right words that I can come up with that is going to fix things. Red Cross volunteers from North Carolina will stay in West Virginia for at least the next two weeks. If you are willing to donate, you can find all the information to donate on WNCN.com.